what is up guys welcome back to the Ange predicts youtube channel i'm Ange, and i predict stuff if you're new to the channel please don't forget to like comment and subscribe with the bell on if you're looking to access my premium parlays for each sport i cover as well as premium picks and betting strategies become a member of my channel today by clicking the join button at the bottom of the video what is up guys welcome back to Ange's daily picks guys for today Thursday, January the 18th, 2024. In this video, I'll be going through my picks for today and I'll be explaining why I am taking them. Please note that these picks are subject to change, guys, based on uh, lineup changes, based on news, injuries, and other factors. So please watch each individual video for the final betting tips. All right, guys, let's get right into the schedule. In the NHL, we have the Avalanche going up against the Bruins. Both of these teams have proven that they could score goals on the game. Uh, like I said, the Avs put in seven goals the other day against, I believe it was the Senators. I'm taking the over 5.5 additional total on the game. Habs versus the Senators. As we speak, the Habs are winning 2-0 against the Devils. Yuri Slavkovsky is a rising player, guys. He scored again. Uh, and Joshua Roy just scored his first goal as well. I like the way these Habs are playing. I'm not saying they're going to win the game, but I'm taking the Habs plus 1.5. Stars versus the Flyers, guys. Edinger's back for the Stars. The Stars are hot. A lot of the players are contributing. Give me the Stars I'm on the money line. Wild versus the Bolts, guys. The last time they played, the Bolts uh, pretty much had their number at 4-1, guys. I do notice that it was an underscore, and I think it could go under again. So give me the under. Blues versus the Capitals. The Capitals usually play well at home, uh, but Robert Thomas, Kairou, and company are holding it down for the Blues. Give me the Blues against spread. Hawks versus Sabres. This, this game was actually postponed, guys. It was supposed to be yesterday, but it's playing today. My pick doesn't change, guys. I'm taking the Sabres on the money line. Leafs versus the Flames. This is a Canadian matchup, guys. Uh, like I said, two, uh, I would say, teams with goaltending question marks here. Give me the over 5.5 on the game. Next up, we have the Kraken versus the Oilers. I know the Kraken recently has had some success. Not in the last few games, though. These Oilers, they are on fire. I, I believe they have a huge streak going. Let's give me the Oilers on the money line. Preds versus the Kings, guys. Uh, the Predators don't usually play well on the road. And the Kings don't play well at home. So it's kind of like a double whammy here. But I do like the roster better on the Kings on paper. So give me the Kings on the money line. Coyotes versus Canucks, guys. Usually I would wait to see who's the goalie for the Coyotes. I do like Ingram, but I just don't think they get past the Canucks. Give me the Canucks in regulation. Rangers versus Vegas. This is two good teams, uh, like one from the Eastern, one from the Western. A good matchup. Uh, but I'll be honest with you guys, these Rangers have been consistent. Give me the Rangers on the money line. NBA, we have the Wizards going up against the Knicks, guys. If you look at the last three times they played, the Knicks uh, had the upper hand two times, in which they covered both times. Give me the Knicks to cover, guys. Bulls versus the Raptors. The Raptors are actually beating the Heat as we speak by, I, bl I believe, at least 20 points. Uh, that's surprising uh, given that they just traded Siakam and like I said, uh, they are missing some players like Potal. But honestly, guys, uh, the last few times they played the Bulls, it went under like three times. So I'm going to take the under. Thunder versus the Jazz. Now, uh, maybe a couple, a month ago or two, I take the Thunder right away, guys. But the way that the Jazz have been playing, I got to go with the Jazz against spread. Grizzlies versus the T-Wolves, guys. Uh, the last few times they played, it was under scores. I believe the Grizzlies didn't even have 90 points, something like that, 95, 92. Uh, the T-Wolves, I know they played yesterday, so I don't think they're going to put up a lot of points. I'm taking the under on this game. Pacers versus the Kings, guys. I believe it's the first time they're playing, uh, if I look at the schedule, against each other. Uh, listen, two huge over teams here. Give me the over. All right, college basketball. We have Minnesota versus Michigan State, guys. Uh, listen, be careful with Michigan State. They are playing very well, uh, showing that they could cover uh, spreads when they're the underdogs. I know Minnesota's a good team, but I'm probably going to take Michigan with the points. Bulls versus the versus Memphis. Uh, Memphis is clearly the better team, guys. More consistent. The Bulls losing games that they shouldn't have and not being able to cover as well. Give me the Memphis to cover. Wichita State versus FAU. I like this matchup. B both teams have been hustling this year. Obviously, you got to give the nod to FAU. Give me FAU on the money line. Panthers versus the Liberty. Uh, listen, obviously, Liberty is a better team. 
I don't think the Panthers are going to put up a lot of points here, so I'll take the under. Illinois versus Michigan. This is going to be another fun game to watch. Michigan is no joke, guys. They've been beating teams that they should not beat. Uh, I have a hard time choosing a side here. I'm going with the over. Western Kentucky versus New Mexico, guys. Listen, I'm not going to waste time here. Western Kentucky, be the better team here. Give me Western Kentucky to cover. Blue Raiders versus Miners. Same story here. The Miners are not better than these Blue Raiders. Uh, give me the, the Miners to cover. Washington, guys, versus Cal. Uh, listen, this Washington team, I, I like the way they've been they've been coached, to be honest, guys. Uh, they've been playing this well this year. Cal, uh, obviously a notch lower. I know they're at home, but I still like Washington here. I'm going to take Washington to cover. Oregon State versus the Utes. The Utes did lose a game, I believe it was last week, that I thought they would be able to win. Uh, Oregon State has showed that they're good against the uh, spread, guys. They're able to stay within it. Will it happen like, tonight? I don't know, guys. But honestly, I'm taking Oregon State plus the points. Oregon versus Colorado, guys. This is two amazing teams. They have amazing records, putting up a lot of points on the board. Usually, the totals are pretty high. I'm going to go with the over on this one, guys. Cougars versus Stanford. Stanford won a big game. I can't remember who they played, if it was Penn State or not, or another team. But like I said, it was a game they definitely shouldn't have won. Uh, maybe this is a turning point for Stanford. Give me the Stanford against the spread. All right, guys, those are my picks for today. I hope you enjoyed them. Check out my final picks tomorrow. I'm Anjan. I'm out of here, guys. Take care and good luck.